The COVID-19 vaccine is now in St. John's County. Today, some workers at Flagler Health Plus got their first doses. This is the first hospital in the county where the vaccinations were made available. News for Jacks reporter Vic Michalucci was there. He's joining us live from St. Augustine. Vic, I'm sure you saw the excitement that this always brings. A lot of people were very happy and relieved to get those shots or at least know that they are coming up in line here. So every day in the emergency department, there are people coming and going potentially with COVID-19. They're exposing the doctors, the nurses, and the staff members here. Right now, there are 27 patients known to have the virus inside this hospital. So those who work here say this is a big help. A quick stick, then a sigh of relief. Flagler Health Plus's medical staff clapped when the first frontline workers got their vaccines. Very minimal, if any, discomfort. Dr. Brian Keekover, who runs the hospital's emergency department, says he did it to keep caring for patients. This allows us to, to feel that we have some sort of immunity against this uh, hidden foe. So it, it gives us power. Flagler received its first batch of Pfizer vaccines this morning. They require ultra cold storage and two doses about two weeks apart. Timing is critical. There were 191 new cases reported on Monday in St. John's County. That's the county's biggest single day increase since the start of the pandemic. That brings the state's total to more than 1.2 million coronavirus cases. Doctors hope this vaccine will cut down on illnesses hospitalizations and deaths. There were periods where uh, we were starting to uh, use a lot of ventilators and a lot of ICU space. Um, that was probably the darkest time. This is the county's first shipment of the vaccine. Over the next few days, the medical workers most likely to be exposed to COVID-19 will have their shot at the immunizations. More shipments in the future will mean more access for other employees. Are you beginning to see light at the end of the tunnel? Absolutely. I think with the vaccine coming out, I'm hoping that this may return some normalcy to this world. 2,000 vaccines in today's batch. And the people that got the shots today and will get them throughout the week are going to come back the week of January the 12th to get their second dose, which of course is required for that Pfizer vaccine. As far as the Moderna vaccine or future shipments, Hospital staff say right now they just don't know. Reporting live in St. Augustine, I'm Vic Michalucci, Channel 4, The Local Station.